Hi there. You've probably already seen the other two videos that I've done previously about this box. So, but if you haven't, I'll put you a link up here. So basically EcoFlow have provided me with the EcoFlow River, um, particularly because I'm into motorhoming and off-grid camping, which basically means camping in a field where you've got no electric. So they sent me this box originally, um, it was half this size, but then they sent me the expansion battery and I've done another video on fitting the expansion battery. Now EcoFlow have kindly sent me this. So this is the 110 watt portable solar panel and I'm going to do you a video now showing you number one how easy this is to fit up and also how it compares to a Renogy 100 watt fixed solar panel. So um, first of all, obviously, I'd just like to say a big thank you to EcoFlow. Uh, the product is absolutely brilliant. And maybe the next video that I do will really go into a lot more detail on what the system actually is and also looking at the mobile application for it because this really is quite a special box and I think it deserves a lot of time spending on it explaining exactly what it is and how it can benefit you. So anyway, let's jump into the video. Hope you enjoy it and if you do, well, maybe you want to go ahead and subscribe to the channel because you'll see more videos like this and other really interesting things. So let's get into it. One of the things that always strikes me about the EcoFlow products is the packaging. Now, I believe that you can tell a lot about a product just by the outer packaging. And to be honest, all of the EcoFlow products have really, really impressed me with their packaging. Uh, they feel quality. And then when you actually open them up and you see nicely presented instructions and the product is nicely boxed, You've got a nice warm feeling about the product before you even open it. So this is the briefcase solar panel and as you can see again it looks quality. It's got a nice zip that uh, basically keeps it together and, and looks like a briefcase. So yeah when you start to fold it out what you'll see inside is the actual solar panel itself. Again it feels quality, it looks quality and the bag itself actually forms part of the, um, the stand, so we won't put that away for the moment. So we'll get the product out and we'll lie it down and it folds out basically into four sections. Here also you can see the Renogy solar panel that I've been testing it against. Uh, the Renogy is a 100 watt panel and again I'm very very impressed with that. But anyway, the EcoFlow system, this is a 110 watt panel, so I'm expecting good things from this. And basically you get these little carabiner clips that you fasten on to the carry case. There's four of them, one for each corner. And then the carry case forms kind of the, um, the, the support mechanism for the panel. So you just clip those to the panel and then you just lay the panel out and, uh, and then it's kind of self-supporting. Obviously, you need to point it in the way of the sun uh, to get the most out of the, uh, the solar charging. And the thing to remember is the EcoFlow panels are not waterproof, so you can't leave them out in the rain. But on the plus side, they are very light and they take up very little space, which is ideal if you're going to be camping or, or hiking with them. Here you can see I'm actually plugging them into an extension lead that I bought, and they use a standard connector, um, so there's no, no fork gone into that. And then back at the EcoFlow River, it comes with a cable to plug it in, and you'll see now it's accepting charge from the solar panel. And again, um, it was a lovely sunny day and I saw it go up to about 90 watts. Um, so yeah, it was doing the job absolutely perfectly. Well, there you go. I hope you enjoyed that short video. There will be another video coming on, um, which will be number four in the series, and that will be a more thorough, in-depth look at the EcoFlow. Thanks a lot for watching, and I hope you've enjoyed it. And if you have, consider subscribing. So bye-bye for now.